Yes, Bob. I apologize for calling this time, Mr. Mm -hmm. President. Yesterday, Dean and I uh, mentioned a paragraph on nonproliferation to you. I'm not sure you had a chance to to see it today. I thought if you did, you could let us you know what you wanted. Oh, I, I thought he was going to write me. He told me he was preparing me a memo, and I never did see it, explaining it, going into it further, discussing it. That's what Rusk said. Well, I uh, evidently he misunderstood because I don't right. really I don't think he did. I'll try to get some. Right. I thought that that's what he said. Now, if he doesn't intend to send anything else, I'll go back on this. I have it right in front of me. Each nuclear weapon state party to this treaty undertakes not to transfer nuclear weapons or other nuclear explosives directly or indirectly to the non-nuclear weapon state or group of states, either individually or or by virtue of its membership in a military alliance or a group of states. Right. Now that's so, the key, Mr. President. What that says to you is that that this proposes we restrict transfer of ownership of the warhead itself. Mm -hmm. And this would still allow us to say to the Germans that if you want to buy into some form of collective ownership of the launch vehicle, a missile or a an airplane, you can do that, but you can't buy into collective ownership of the warhead itself, which, uh, of course, they never could have anyhow, because we don't have authority under the law to to transfer ownership of the warhead. But, no, but hadn't, didn't MLF contemplate that we would get an amendment to that? No, sir, it, it didn't. It did not. All right. not, not, not with respect to ownership. Not to relinquish its control over its nuclear weapons or other nuclear explosives. Well, that's, that's the law now. We can't that's do right. it. That's right. And yeah. not in any way to assist, encourage, or induce any non-nuclear weapon state to manufacture or otherwise acquire nuclear weapons or other nuclear weapons. The key, the key sentence in there, Mr. President, is that one you read at first, which says that you can't transfer directly or indirectly to a single nation or, in effect, a group of nations, ownership in the warhead. Now, what, are the, what are the Germans say about The Germans will will uh, grumble about it. And uh, I think there's some in state who oppose this. That particular language was drafted by Dean himself. Bob Bowie, uh, for example, I, I think opposes it. Dean favors it. I favor it. What will the Russians do? It? We're not sure they'll accept it. It is not the language that Gromyko uh, uh, proposed, but it... Uh, it, we, we think there's a reasonable chance they'll either accept this or suggest some uh, relatively minor modification of it. 